This is the Reliance 4G Wi-Fi port. This is what Reliance wants its customers to upgrade from a CDMA device to a Reliance Wi-Fi port 4G. Its features would be download speed up to 150 Mbps, upload speed up to 50 Mbps, battery capacity 2300 mAh, micro SD card slot and would connect up to 31 Wi-Fi users. So let's take a look what do we have inside the box. So this is the device Wi-Fi port. It has a battery indicator out here, a power button. It has a 4G indicator, a data indicator, Wi-Fi indicator and WPS. And out here it has a USB port. And on the left we have a WPS button to activate the WPS. And let's see what else do we have in this box. So we have a battery. A 23 mAh battery. And we have a USB cord. And we have the user manual and a warranty card inside. So this is the warranty card. So let's turn on the device and let's try to connect this. So this is the rear side of the device. This is where the SIM card slot is and this is the micro SD card slot. So let's put the 4G SIM card in there. And let's put the battery inside. Let's turn it on. So Reliance has launched 4G services across India in most of the places. This is from Pune. So I would have a green signal where it shows 4G. Yeah, that's the green signal. And this is for the Wi-Fi signal and this is the battery indicator. So let me take you through the installation on your computer and we'll also test its speed and connectivity. So I have connected the 4G device to my computer. So let's see how the installation goes. Go to my computer. Go to Reliance Drive, hit on Setup, hit Next, 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 Install. can see that the device has been connected. Hit finish and the device is running. So let's go to the Reliance 4G home page. The default password would be admin. Username and password is admin. And on the connection tab, you can see the upload and download speed and the total megabytes utilized. On the setting tab, you can 
do some basic settings set the Wi-Fi key as per your choice and some settings here you can access the SD card and here's the status of the device if there's any user connected on your Wi-Fi this is where you would see the user list so let's do a quick speed test So it's been a couple of hours Reliance has launched 4G in Pune and my experience after using 4G for a couple of hours is pretty decent, much better than Airtel. And I bought this device for 899 since I was an existing user. I was using the Reliance Pro 3 which was a CDMA device and now Reliance wants its customers to be upgraded but for new customers this device would cost you around 3100 So the speed test has started. So this is the result for the speed test. It is a pretty decent speed. So this is all about the Reliance 4G device. Thank you for watching the video. Do give it a thumbs up if you like it. And comment below if you have any questions. And also hit the subscribe button to watch some more videos. Thank you so much. Goodbye.